Welcome back friends. So we've had this cooler now all summer long, the Yeti Hopper M30, and we're gonna give you guys a proper review. Stay tuned. guys like I mentioned in the intro we've had this cooler now all summer long and it's been on I don't know 15 boat trips six or seven camping trips we've really put it through the ringer I think we're at the point where we can give you an honest review on it let's get started with the main reason we bought this Yeti we for a long time we could not imagine spending three hundred dollars on a cooler blah 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 you know how much ass I can buy for three hundred nine dollars well they finally got us instead of the old zipper that you have to fight all the time on the old hoppers this one has a magnetic top. So basically you just prop it open and it shuts itself. So you never have to worry about the kids leaving it open. You never have to worry about this much zipper not being open and letting all that hot air in. Every time you close it, it's closing all the way. All right, so that's definitely gonna help to keep that ice a little bit longer. To give you an example of where we're coming from, this is our old cooler here, our old soft cooler here. This is an REI brand. And I'd say it's probably a half an inch thick in there. And it would keep ice for most of the day. So if we were out on the lake, it was 90, 95 degrees. It would keep ice most of the day. By the evening, it's mostly gone, all right? Well, I'm gonna show you this one. It's, we're filming on a Sunday. We put this ice in here on a Friday afternoon before we left, about 4.30 in the afternoon. And it is now two o'clock on a Sunday. 10 pounds of ice. And it's still really, really slushy. So, I'm pretty impressed with that. I think this definitely outperforms the REI cooler. Why do you need ice for six days anyway? Now granted, this was three times as much as the REI cooler, but I think that uh, I think this makes this cooler worthwhile. And I'll give you a better look at that magnetic shut. That's it. I mean, literally every single time it's going to shut. I was Townley, our seven-year-old. She was getting in there a minute ago, and I didn't have to worry about her zipping it all the way back up or being able to unzip it at all. Um, yeah, it's, another thing that's really a pain in the old hoppers or in these hoppers overall is how to load it so this is a fairly sturdy movement right here we just prop it open this is a this is a stir from an old uh, ice cream maker so we just prop it open with this and we're able to load it no problem so that was a that was another selling point for us a lot of people will just stick their arm in there and keep it open like that you can do that but if you do this you still got both your hands obviously another thing we did decide to go with was the little sidekick and i wasn't wasn't sure about the sidekick at first i didn't i didn't know if it was just a waste of 50 bucks but uh i think i'm glad we got it what do you think bro you think so yeah i think we use it every trip yeah we use it every trip it's totally waterproof again it's magnetic so you can see the line of magnets there we put our wallets in there our phones uh you know even if it were fall in the lake off the boat we still be safe and when it once it closes with the magnet and you shut it I mean you can see it's it's airproof in there it's not I can't even squeeze any air out of there all right so here's what I haven't done this is gonna be fun this is this is totally off the script right here not that we had a script we've got about 10 pounds of ice in here and water I'm gonna pick it up over my head and see if it dumps out what do you think Brooke? think it will oh gosh <laughs> <I guess> we'll <laughs> we, see. all right let's see if it's as waterproof as they say it is Lucky you. <laughs> Lucky me, yeah, I guess so, all right. So, um, so yeah, that's it. That's the Yeti M30. It's, uh, it's a lot of money to spend on a cooler. There's no doubt about that. But this one has lasted us six or seven years, and this one is built like a tank compared to this one. So we should get easily 15, 20 years out of this thing. I mean, I think so, really. And then Brooke was a big fan. This is the river green color. Uh, you like this color. It's, it's my kind of, favorite color. It's your favorite color, no doubt. Yeah. We've got a couple of cups in that color too, but uh, I think that's what sold us was the magnetic opening and closing for sure, and then uh, the color. We thought the color was cool too. So I hope you enjoyed this review. Pretty simple. You guys have seen a lot of different reviews on these hoppers before, but we wanted to show you the new one with the magnetic tops. I think it makes this cooler worthwhile, at least in our opinion. So I hope this was useful. Uh, if it was, consider subscribing. Thanks, guys.